Howdy cowboy. Welcome back to another Alaska vlog. Today, Johnny boy and I are gonna be hiking. There's a little trail behind our grandparents' house. It's like a five mile hike, I believe. We've done it before. And then there's like a little glacier pond. It's super clear water. There's some little grayling in there. You guys have seen us catch grayling before. They're pretty cool. They're kind of like a trout, but they got a big, big dorsal fin. They kind of look like betta fish almost. Not really, but they're kind of like betta fish. They're super pretty. And uh, we're hoping we can do a little catch clean cook action. It is a little foggy. Well, not foggy, but cloudy because we are so high up in elevation. The clouds have taken over the mountainside. So I don't know if we're gonna be able to get, you know, all that pretty scenery, but it's still gonna be pretty no matter what. Yeah, as Sam said, we're in the great state of Alaska still. And right now we're at our grandparents' house. This is it right here. It's their homestead they've had in their family for years. And it is gorgeous outside. So beautiful, picture perfect Alaska day. Sam and I legit have a six mile hike in and a six mile hike back. Gonna be an absolute grind. Maybe see some bears, maybe see some moose, but today's target species is the Alaskan grayling. All right, Sam and I made it to the start of the trailhead. This is where our six mile hike begins. And Sam Lehman looks like he's hot already. <laughs> it's a steamy one, dude. That jacket that we got on, ooh. But this is what it looks like right now. It looks pretty cool. I wish the clouds weren't here because this is a giant mountain, but it's Alaska. So Alaska is going to do what Alaska wants to do. We're going to start this hike and hopefully me and Sam don't die. Well, I don't know how well you guys can hear me, but we made it to the halfway mark, and the halfway mark is absolutely gorgeous. There's a little creek and a bridge that you have to cross to get over to the Grayling Lake that we're going to. But I mean, it does not get any prettier than this. It's just, just, I mean, take it in guys. It's beautiful. I wish the clouds weren't here because there's giant mountains everywhere, and oh my gosh, I love it. So like I said, Sam and I made it the halfway point, and we still got a long ways to go. Uh, but luckily the views are only going to get better and better. We are getting very, very close to our final destination. There's a couple uh, glacier lakes along the way that there are some fish in there. I'm not sure if there's grayling in there, but I think there are some Dolly Vardens, yellowfin Dolly, Dolly Vardens in there. I'm tired and we're walking through this giant like field of rocks and it's like, I feel like a mountain goat out here. And I mean, the views are just insane. Look, look, look at that in the camera. You can see the clouds above me. We're in a little mountain right Show now. that way though? Oh yeah, I showed them this way. The lake right here is so pretty. I'm gonna show you guys again. I mean, this looks like from a movie. Like that, 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 that can't be real, right Sam? Like no. this, this can't be real. I don't think so, bro. Just thought I'd bring up the camera and show you guys the awesome views. We wanted to showcase the gray lane, obviously, in this video, but also kind of like the beauty that Alaska has to offer. And man, it's doing a great job. What do you think, Michael? I think uh, it's time for you guys to carry me over all these rocks. It looks like you're a little cold. No, I'm perfect. A few moments later. Samuel Lehman. We made it. Oh my goodness. I am sweating so bad. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that was a hike. And just like time reference for you guys, it took us three hours and 15 minutes to do that hike. Whew. That's a long freaking time, but it was all worth it. We got some good views and now we're at our final destination and we're gonna see if we can get some grayling for you guys. And uh, we're gonna be busting out the fly rods here, get down here and hopefully catch some fish. So we'll see you guys on the GoPros. Well, I'm just approaching the lake here. Uh, the boys are coming down here just a little bit, but I figure Sammy boy might as well come down here. Oh, it's a chicken, dude. It's a ptarmigan. Yeah. Look at them. Oh, there's like three of them. One, two, little babies. I don't know if you guys can see that. They're right here. Look at them. Look at them fly, my guy. <laughs> oh, there's a whole flock of them. Where would a grayling beat. I have caught a lot of grayling. They're kind of easy to catch though. They're not really difficult, but you know. Oh, there's one right here. That was a good one. Sheesh. 
Piece of eats. He was scared of it, that's for sure. He was sitting right next to the rock though. Oh, he, he missed it. Oh my god. Well, he was sitting like right here. And then I spooked him and he came out here into this deep section. I cast it in there and he ate it. And then he, I hooked him for like a split second and it came off. I'm just using a little, I don't even know what it is, just a bead head. I think it's some type of nymph maybe, I don't know. Man. I'm not a big fly expert, but there's like 50 little ones in this little corner here. There's a good drop off here. I think there's gray. Might be sitting on it. I don't know though. Make a good cast out there. We'll let it sink down. And we can just watch our line. If we get a bite, it'll straighten out and shoot out. But we're on. We're on like Donkey Kong. First grayling of the trip. You guys can see him. It's a decent one too. Not a bad one. Oh yeah. Look at him. Is, he, is this one a respectable size to eat? Yeah. After a three hour hike. Three hour hike. I probably don't need that many fish to eat, but this one is an absolute beautiful grayling. Look at that. I've caught a few in my life, but not very many. But this is a long, oh no, chill, eat, chill, eat. I would take really good care of him, but since he's gonna be dinner, we're gonna bonk him on the head. But look at that color on him. Blue, red, black spots, big, long dorsal, like I was saying. So we're gonna take a rock here. Thank you, buddy. You are gonna be a delicious dinner. All right, they're absolutely a munch in top water over here. I haven't caught a single thing yet because I'm not as good as Samuel. So I think I'm tossing on like a little caddis imitation. Uh, they're just getting after it. Hopefully this is going to do the trick. All right, boys, I'll put on the old dry fly. I'm not a big wet fly guy, more of a dry fly kind of guy. So hope you guys are excited for some topwater eats because I am ready to catch a fish. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, look at him, dude. First cast in. Oh, I just got clapped, bro. The dry fly, the dry fly bite is on. Let me wet my hands real quick. And then we're going to grab this son of a gun. Oh yeah, boys, my first grayling. That fish literally came out of the water for that. That is so cool. All right, my first fish going back in the water. There he goes. That was epic. I knew switching to the dry fly was gonna be the move. It's my confidence bait and I see a lot of them rising. So it's about to get weird. Oh my God, they're coming completely out of the water for it. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh yeah, I got a better one on boys. It's my first good one of the day. Oh my goodness, the dry fly is the real deal. Oh yeah, oh, shnikes. I'm nervous. Samuel, woo! Yes. Oh my, a beautiful, beautiful grayling. Look at that, and they got that big dorsal as you guys can see. Yes. I think I'm keeping this one for dinner. This one looks like it's gonna be too delicioso for a little meal, so I'm definitely taking this bad boy home. Oh my God. There's some absolute tanks in here, dude. The problem is, how am I going to get to them? Oh, look at this one. Here we go. Look at this guy. <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> Here he goes. Back in the water. There's 
like five of them in here, dude. They're just chunguses, too. Has it? <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Don't come off! Don't come off! That's a good one. That's a good one. Oh, John! Big, big, big. Oh, this one's gonna be dinner. Oh yeah. Look at that thing, that thing's a tank. Well, I came here to the little outlet and I bonked him in the head, but here's our nice grayling. And look at that. Isn't that so pretty, dude? Oh yeah. Such really cool fish, he fought super hard. And uh, he's gonna be absolutely delicious. And that is a beautiful fish to take home with us. Oh my, oh my God. Oh my God. There's some freaking tanks over here. Dude, there's like mondos. Oh, get out of here. Oh, oh, it's a good one. Oh, it is a good one. Oh, I didn't see this one. I was looking at a bigger one and then this one come and murked me. Not a bad one. Oh God, yeah. Merc the dry fly, dude. The dry fly is doing it. Oh, 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 Sam, 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 right, right here. Oh my God, oh, 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 yeah, 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 see him? Oh, oh, he's like a 16 incher. Oh God, oh my God, oh God. I, I, I lost track of him. Oh my God, it was so big though. But oh my goodness, guys. I just saw a giant one, so I got distracted from the one that I just caught. Uh, oh my God, look at this one though. All right, guys. There's my awesome grayling. Biggest one that I've ever caught, probably. Going back in the water. See you later, Bubba. And yep, right there. Right there, dude. Sam and I are stalking like an absolute tank. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Did you bite it? Yep. You have him. Yep. You have him. Is that him? That yeah, might be him. I don't know. I don't think it's him. No, no, he's still back though. That's I was gonna say. One, it is a good one. Oh, it no, is. No, not like yet. I don't know. Think so? I don't I saw know. A way bigger one, I thought. Barely had him too, dude. Look at that. Let me. Oof, that. Hey, buddy. I'm sure they'll bite again. I should have told you about him. I should not have told you. I should have told you about this spot. Little boy. Dad, this one can I That's not him. Not him. No. no. Oh, is this him, dude? Johnny, is this him? Absolutely two tanks over there. Oh. You can cast your dad if you want. There we go, another nice one. He's breaking me off. No. There's one. Oh, dude, broke me off. Really? Yep. Snap me off.
Oh. There's a there's a decent one. This is not the Chungus one, but this is another good one. Oh wow. I mean this was actually better than I thought it was, but there's a daddy chungus that's way bigger. Oh look at this one, Sam. Holy crap. Another just beautiful, gorgeous fish here. As you guys can see. Hopefully you guys can see on the GoPro decently. I wish he would fin his tail. But oh such a gorgeous fish. Alright, see you later, Bubba. Not the best release I was trying to do, but it'll work. He's totally fine. Tomorrow. Do you wanna smell it, Ricky? <laughs> well, it is the next day, and uh, that hike was not fun. You guys did not miss much. We had another five mile hike back out, and I uh, didn't think you guys really wanted to see that again, but Sam and I, we were ready to be done when we got back to the house. But next day, as I was saying, and now it's time for the moment that you guys have been waiting for. We are gonna yes. cook these graylings up. The oh the God. Olympics is the girls are fast in the Olympics. Oh my God! A hundred meter race. They took gold, silver, and bronze. Oh. And broke the winner, oh wow. Broke the Olympic record. Oh, that's really cool. Well, yeah, that's cool. So, Grammy, do you want some grayling? Grammy, I, do you want do you want to say anything to the our fans, our friends? Well, these two guys are tough, strong, excellent fishermen, and they happen to be my grandsons. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Well, we're gonna start cooking these. Right, um, I think we're gonna do it just. Potatoes are not gonna be ready for about another. That's fine. I'll take uh, the thirty girl. minutes, maybe. What do you think? That's fine because the I girl's have to gonna turn take them over 30 in minutes. about twelve minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're gonna cook these. Gonna... Oh, here's our fish. We're gonna slap her right on the grill here. Oh God, yeah, bud. Oh yeah. So what you guys missed was while well, we were filming the whole, you know, how to cook it and stuff like that inside there my grandma was just talking and i didn't want to tell her to stop talking so basically what we did with it we opened it up and we seasoned uh the insides of the grayling now there was paprika oregano leaves salt pepper and maybe one other thing basil i think and that's pretty much what you put inside of the fish and then we also stuck little strips of butter in there and then to wrap everything up we wrapped it up in the tin foil and now it's going on the grill so we're going to leave that in there for probably it i mean this grill's ripping and it's not going to take very long so i'm thinking maybe eh, three minutes each side and then it should be good so hopefully you guys are excited as i am because I've never had grilling before. I am looking forward to trying it and I wish you guys could be here with me to try it as well. Eventually. Oh boy. Look at that thing, That dude. looks unreal, man. Look at Ian. Some of it's already flopped out a little bit. Oh, let me see Should that. we go in for a bite? Ooh, yeah, Look at that it. white flaky, cheers. Oh dude, that's good. Is it good? I need to go in for a piece up here. Oh yeah. Oh, look at that piece, white and flip. That's so good. It looks like walleye, dude. Here, we're gonna go in for another bite. Oh yeah, you need to get into this. That's good. It tastes, I would say it does taste a little different than trout. It tastes more like, it's less gamey than trout, I would say. I don't know, I, I thought it tasted pretty good, but that's where we're gonna end today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We chased after a rare species in the mountains. So we're gonna eat dinner right now. You can see us up there and check out this view. Sheesh, we get to eat with this gorgeous view. I mean, it does not get any better than that. I don't know about you guys, but I have really, really been enjoying making these videos for you guys in Alaska. It's just something way different that you don't get to do back home. And ah, I was telling Sam, one of these days, I really wanna move out here and just make so much content for you guys to watch. The All this stuff would be endless. Like you would see so much different types of stuff and man, this state is so beautiful. If you guys are thinking about traveling out here, definitely do it. Make sure to click the subscribe button, hit the like button for this video as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. <laughs>